This is the demonstration of smart power glass sensor door which is used in shopping mall and airport door also it is called model GD200 by 5. This is the aluminium channel. This aluminium channel, the height of this channel is around 5 inches and this width is around 4 inches. So this channel is normally 4.2 meter long. Two number of channel, one channel is 2.1 meter and another will be 2.1 meter. So normally this is a 4.2 meter long and which you will get the 2 meter opening sensor door. In this particular demonstration, I am showing you only with the single door. So this is a heavy duty model. This is with the double rail line technology. You can see this is a, this is the first rail line and at the top is a double rail line. This is the, this is the second rail line. And between the first and second rail line, there is a rubber strip. There is a rubber strip, black color of rubber strip, which is for the soundless operation. So this is a double rail line technology. After three or four years of operation, you don't have to change the entire channel. You just change the this small this channel, and then the system will be working okay. So this is the sensor door. This is a heavy duty brushless DC motor, 24 volt DC brushless motor. And this is a microcontroller and this is the power supply. Normally in the earlier model, the microcontroller and power supply was together. But now we have separated the power supply and the microcontroller separate. This is the power supply and this left side is the microcontroller. So that in case of any power fault, the microcontroller no need to change. So this side is the motor. And you can see, I will show you the packing. When you start the open the packing, so this is the rubber belt. You can see this is the this is the rubber belt. Okay. So from this side. So this is the in the standard packaging, you will get the 7 meter rubber belt. And you open this. This is a push switch. This is a wireless push switch. A normal sensor door. You don't get the push switch, but we have given you the push switch also, so that when you can push in the sensor door, you can open and close. There are, this is the microcontroller and this is the power supply. There is a separate remote switch also in optional, this is optional. So with this remote switch, when you can press, you can open and you can close. You can open the door. These are the door hangers. There are the four door, door hangers. These are the four door hangers. You can see. These are the door hangers. You can see these are the four do door hangers. And then you will get the glass clamp also. Please open the glass clamp. These are the glass clamps. Below the door hanger, below the door hanger, the glass clamp will be fit. Glass will be fitted inside this. But there are the three holes, but in the actual glass, you don't have to make any holes. Just the screw tight, and this will hold the 12 mm toughened glass inside. So these are the four door hangers. In addition, you have got a two number of motion sensor. Now normally these are the 24 gigahertz expensive type microwave sensor, not an ordinary type of IR sensor. These are the 24 gigahertz motion sensor and these are the, all the hardware accessories. This is the motor. This is a DC 24 volt brushless motor with the gearbox and this is a photo beam sensor. This is a photo beam sensor, safety sensor. When somebody will come in between, when the door is opening, you will see the photo beam sensor I will be connected here. When somebody will come in between, when the door are closing, when somebody will come in between, you will see the somebody will come in between, the door will not open. Door will open automatically. So this is about the glass sensor door. Once you start the installation, first you have to fix this aluminium channel 4.2 meter and use this water level. 
so you have to use this water level so that you have to ensure that the channel is fully horizontal the channel should not be tilted and you have to put the screws this insulation is not proper this is the screws but you have to put the screws in the zigzag manner up and down zigzag manner so that it is properly installed you can also install this channel on the toughen glass in the glass directly also that is also possible now we are we are showing you the insulation which has been done on the wooden wall so you have to first install this channel after that you have to insert the controller and the power supply and the motor and you have to put the belt belt has to be properly fitted this is the belt connector you can see this is the belt connector this is the proper belt connector and the on the left hand side is the pulley so this is about the glass sensor door now i will show you the connection diagram also there are the three sensor one is the inside sensor the left one is for the inside sensor the middle one is for the outside sensor the right one is for the photo beam sensor you can see this inside sensor the pin number is 1 2 3 4 1 1 1 red and black is the power supply and green and yellow is the nonc contact if you give me the tweezer if you short the nonc contact if you short any any nonc contact if you short this nonc contact 3 and 4 the door will start opening so this is for the testing whenever there is a motion sensor is working the nonc contact 3 or 4 will be shorted and the door will start operating this is the one model where there are the three connectors you can see these are the connectors on the left hand side middle side and the right hand side and this is the microcontroller and you can see in the manual page number 18 and 19 all the details of the connections are given now in the new model we are, we will be having connector like this so this will be 1 2 3 4 12 so this 1 and 2 will be power supply and 3 or 4 will be nonc for the inside sensor again 5 and 6 will be the power supply 7 and 8 will be for the photo beam sensor again 9 and 10 will be the power supply and 11 and 12 will be the nonc contact for the outside sensor you can see this is the new manual the manual number page number 20 you will find all the details <coughs> so this is about our glass sensor door gd200 by 5 one i will now show you the cover this is also coming with the cover this is the cover this is a factory supplied beautiful cover aluminium cover normally the motion sensor is connected here but in a office we have not connected the motion sensor because every time the people will go it will be a disturbance so instead of motion sensor we have connected the hand scanner when i touch by hand you can see the door will open i can connect either the motion sensor or i can connect the hand scanner or i can directly connect the wireless push switch also this is a wireless push switch i push it the door will open and door will close this wireless push switch is auto programmed with this controller you don't have to do any coding <coughs> and this is the <coughs> optional switch <coughs> this is the photo beam sensor so this photo beam sensor is connected with the eyes this is the one eye this one is another eye both these eyes are connected with this photo beam sensor so that when somebody will come in between the door will not close so this is about the brief description about the smart power <coughs> auto glass sensor door gd200 by 5 model this is only a training video for the people who want to install this sensor door for any more query please contact us at www.smartpower.co.in thank you very much bahut bada hoega sir